Alola friends, Dapper Drabby here, and what I'm about to show you is a uh, is a video I did back in uh, September. Um, I was hoping to push it onto another channel to post for something specific, uh, random pack or something like that, but it failed to uh, go through like that. So I thought I'd use this moment to do a little bit of hype up for uh, what I'm gonna call as my last video of the year. I'm I've. And as well as introduce you, introduce you into this uh, video from a little while ago that was this is the best pull I've ever gotten. Um, but without further ado, I'm going to go over what we're going to do. This is going to be our last video of the year coming up. It's going to be posted on the 23rd. And don't mind the Malasada music. It's just playing in the background. Um, but yeah, it's going to be paying homage to my most popular video um, through for, for the whole year, and that was the Alolan Raichu versus Lycan Rock Elite Trainer Kit. So what that was was a little thirty deck versus thirty deck versus that played out against each other, and I believe Lycan Rock won due to weakness. Um, but I thought I'd do a sixty versus sixty, and here's just a few, a few examples of some things I'm putting in it. But I'm gonna be putting the best. Alolan Raichu deck versus the best Lycanroc deck. Um, and, I mean, with a few tweaks. So, like, here's here's the promo a Lycanroc. I could not find the, the promo um, Raichu from that same thing. But uh, he's number 30 out of 30 for the Lycanroc theme deck here. Um, so what I'm doing is I'm taking... I might even take this Rockruff, actually, if the promo Rockruff. And, uh... Making a Rock Rough Lycan Rock deck and making a Raichu deck. And kind of using the cards that are best in each of these decks. Now, Raichu does have a small following for what's good in it, so I'm going to go over that first. And then you guys will probably recognize some of the cards I'm adding into, uh, into uh, Lycan Rock. So, starting off with Electric Energy, we're going to have quite a few of these because Raichu uh, GX does who we're adding in here. So, what we're basically doing. This is the star of the deck right here. Alolan Raichu Surge Surfer uh, Psychic. So we're going to have plenty of stadiums that are going to keep going in play so that we can have free retreat. And then Psychic does 20 more damage times the amount of energy on our opponent's active Pokemon. So we're going to be playing three of these guys, actually. And uh, a bunch of lightning energy. Uh, I don't think we'll play DCE because we have uh, plenty of ways of accelerating energy. We're going to play the good Pikachus. So the uh, McDonald's promo. The uh, pin collection promo, and if I can pull up the serial promo, um, we're gonna play a couple copies of. Oh, that's why it was sticking. We're gonna play a couple copies of Raichu GX for just as a backup attacker, but our main attacker is going to be the Alolan Raichu. But I mean, in my personal opinion, this is like a Alolan Raichu GX because it's from Shining Legends, guys. It's better mascot right there. We're also going to add a shiny, uh, a Raikou with Shining Body. This is a great secondary attacker, and he's used for, for one main thing that I'll show you in a second. And we're going to use Buzz Zap Thunder to be able to boost those electric energies, get them down quickly, and be able to take control of the game quickly. And then a couple Tapu Leles to finish it out. So this is the reason why we're playing both Electrode and Raikou is the counter energy. We're able to throw this down on Raikou and Electrode. We can blow up an Electrode and then start using it right away because our opponent took a prize. So I really like this in the Raichu deck because it can count as two lightning energies um, during your turn. And then, of course, if we're down, why not use Counter Catcher, right? So there's a few things that we'll be playing in the uh, Raichu deck there. Let's go over a few things that we're going to be playing in the Lycanroc deck. These decks will be complete 60 cards, and we'll do a, a legendary battle with them at the end of the year. No, don't knock over Carl. Um, you guys didn't see that. He did not just lose lose a uh, a fin there. There you go. Sorry about that, Carl. So, a few things we will be playing in the Lycanroc deck. Um, of course, we will not be playing this Lycanroc. It's just a little little weak. It's not strong enough for what we're trying to do. So of course we'll play some fighting energy, but we also play double colorless. Um, and you'll see why. But this is the main Lycan Rock we're going to use. Uh, I'm going to use three of them, I believe. This one I did not sort. Uh, we're going to basically use Dangerous Claws as much as possible. 
uh, if it's a basic Pokemon on our opponent, hit for 60 damage. And with weakness, that's going to double to 120 damage, which is kind of what we're hoping for. And then corner is just a good secondary attack. And then we'll play a few of these guys, a few of the Bloodthirsty Eyes, because it is like in Rock GX. Um, so we're going to play a couple of them. And then I think you guys just saw a peek of that last card I'm playing, but... Let me go ahead and move this one up here first. Show you the full art beauty that is like in Rock GX. And then, of course, we're going to pair him with his favorite partner, the wolf and the fox, is some Zoroark GX. We're going to keep this to a very low count, though. Probably only um, a 2-2 two, two, um, or a 3-2-1, where we have, like, one of the standard one. But, uh, yeah, primarily that's... What we're doing. So the way I figured I'd split it up is there's going to be no Lele's in the Lycanroc deck. And there's going to be a couple Lele's in this. So it's like this one gets Zoroark, this one gets Lele. And it's kind of even like that. So let me go ahead and you guys, introduce you guys to the video from September. I'll see you guys later. Bye bye. Alola friends. Dapper Drabby here. And we're going to do a kind of a random pack today. As you can see we're a little bit in nature. I'm actually in my car. Um, this is the window right here. Um, that's preventing the phone from falling. So it's actually working as a pretty good tripod. But we got some random packs for you today, guys. We have some Guardians Rising. We got this from a three-pack blister. Um, but we have a Komo'o pack, a Tapu Koko pack, and a Lycanroc pack. And we'll probably open them up in that order. Um, as you can see, we're kind of off, just off the highway over here. But uh, I thought, why not get some random packs uh, and check out what we get. We have no sleeves, no nothing, um, and, uh, that's a green code card. That sucks. Okay, so, I guess I'll slide that back into the pack. We'll do the pack trick here. Three, four, and then two. I want to make sure not to drop any of the cards, obviously, for obvious reasons, right? So, let's see what we got. We have a Murkrow. Helioptile, Machop, I'm like, what's the best way to hold these? Slowpoke, Alolan Volpix, that beacon right there. Some water energy, yeah, we're not going to guess the energy today. Tentacool, a Max Potion, Machoke, Reverse Foil is a Beldum, and our rare in the pack is a Sogaleo. There we go. So Shining Arrow for nothing, right? <laughs> shining Arrow does 50 damage to one of your opponent's benched Pokemon. So let's put that one back in there. We'll bust into Top of Coco now and see what we get in that. And, oh, yikes, that one did not open up as pretty as the other pack. So that's that. But, uh, one, two, three, and four. Okay, let's see what we get. We get a Panchan. Snow Runt. Chauncey! Machop, with that dab. Machop dab. The little turtle, the turtle turtle, a little sand shrew, and lightning energy. Field Blower, very nice. Pseudo Wudo. That roadblock, Lampant, will Reverse Foil, Enhanced Hammer, and our rare is a Swellow. Not so yellow. So, nothing so far, but let's see. We have one more pack over here. We'll get that opened up. Just give me one moment. Put the other cards away. Here, just look at nature. Look at nature. Our favorite, right here, Lycanroc. Let's see what comes in this pack today. Uh... I don't know what we're hoping for. I guess anytime you open up Guardians Rising, you're hoping for one thing specific. But, ooh, okay, so this is a good code card. I will give you guys this code at the end of this. But first, we will do uh, the card trick. One, two, three, four. To the front. That's what I'll do. I'll just do four to the front. Can't guess the energy because I already revealed it. It's a grass energy, guys. I totally guessed that right. Of course it's a grass. We're in grass. Oh man, what's with this? Like, I was like, what happened? The lighting decided to like stop working. There we go, there we go. We can see it now. Grass energy. So what are we got in this? We have Hakuma-oh. How come though? 
Fly score with that finishing stinger. Clefable. Clefairy. A vanillaite. Wishy washy going to school. Goomy. Goomy, goomy, goo. We got a wind pod. Reverse foil is a rare. Sogaleo. And, okay, guys. Let's make sure the lighting's right here, right? And our rare is. <laughs> I found her! <laughs> I found her in the forest! <laughs> oh my gosh, guys. Talk about random. So random. Such a beauty right here. Look at that. They like the little pattern. Ah, uh, putting this right back into the card pack. I'll sleeve this immediately when I get home, guys. It is the Secret Rare Tapu Lele GX. And <laughs> on that note, uh, enjoy, enjoy some nature, guys. This has been Dapper Drabby, and I will bid you guys a Lola. Thank you so much for coming out, and I will see you on the next video. Bye-bye.